I made my career in Kaisha as a um, director and then executive director for 15 years. And then I left for a while. <laughs> I went to another bank in the system and then I, I came back. Kaisha was the first bank to have uh, branches online in Cape Verde. Kaisha was the first one to introduce the credit cards in Cape Verde to provide it to you know, government officials to managers for big companies. Kasha was one to start with Western Union operation in Cape Verde. So now all banks are doing, but we were the one to, to introduce them. So we have uh, internet banking, we have all um, uh, modern facility for, for our clients, and we intend to keep leading in innovation. We are, as I said, we are uh, ready. I mean, to support all many, pro, all most important projects for the country. So, mm -hmm. we, and we have the ability, we have the financial capacity. And uh, when we don't have enough financial capacity or enough financial muscle, we have connection, we have partnership, and we can go and bring partners. Capital is booming. Tourism is booming. But there's other opportunities for investment in Cape Verde. Transportation, inter-island transportation is a key uh, factor for all uh, overall development of, of the country. All investors that are willing to invest in this area, tourism, transportation, they can rely on us for, to support their finance. So we are ready to, to provide what they need. If the project is big enough for us, uh, for us, as I said, we can find partners to work. For each promoter, if the project is big enough for our limit concentration, we find partners. One can see that Cape Verde is a nice place to live and to invest. Very peaceful country, you know, no social conflict, no war, um, very nice climate, very beautiful beaches, very clear water, um, very stable government, government provide incentive for investment, so the climate is, is uh, I would say, the environment is, is favorable for, for investment. Private individuals is now 58% um, of deposit and is 34% uh, of credit. The existing conditions uh, shows that uh, the opportunity for growth is in business, in Absolutely. corporation. So we're going to move a little bit for, to corporation. Our offer ranges from microfinance. We have a, a, a microfinance program to corporate finance, to project finance, so to big projects. So we cover everything. We cover all Cape Verdeans in the country, resident and non-resident immigrants and also foreign investors, so we cover everybody, so we cover all financial needs of, of Cape Verde, from the beginning to, to the end. I would invite them to look at Cape Verde, to see what is happening here, to try to know a little bit for, the, for those uh, who are not Cape Verdean, to look at what's happening in this country, and they, I'm sure they will find an opportunity. They will identify uh, a niche for their own development, for their own business. Also for Cape Verde, to look at what is happening, because some of these Cape Verde um, lost some contact with Kant for a while. So it's time for them to look at it again and see what is happening, and I'm sure they can find also an opportunity for them to bring their experience their professional skills, because we need professional skills in, in this country. And our immigrants community can give a very important contribution in this, in this.